In this example, I'm going to show you how to do a multi-dimensional array. Now, Python arrays are, you, are actually lists with lists. But if you want to do a multi-dimensional one, it is basically a list within a list. Now, this is an example of a multi-dimensional array. So the first thing I'm going to show you is how you can have a list within a list. So one, two, three, four, five. So what we have here is position zero in the array and position one. So now what I can do is print that and print position one. So I'll just show you that running. going to save that in my Python app folder. So what I can do there, sorry, I put a bit of an error there, is that prints position one, which is three, four, five. Now the other thing I can do is I can actually set up so names arrays so array Jennifer, and step. So that's my first one. And then I've got names two. And what I can do is I can create an array of both of these. So final names equals names and names two. And what I can do now is I can actually pick a specific position. So if I want to print John, Okay, I happen to know that the second one is position one, so I can now go to print final names. Let me just open the brackets on that and I know it's position one, which is names two. And I know the name is also in position one. So what I do now is if I run that, it shows me John. If I changed it to two, it should show me James. So that's one way of approaching multi-dimensional arrays. You can actually set up your lists and then join them so that you can pick on the specific array that you need.